What's up, guys? I'm about to replace the batteries in my CyberPower 1500 VA. They just died. It, they lasted about four years and nine months. Symptoms I got was my computer would shut down, and also in the middle of the night, this thing would make an alarm, and there'd be a little red battery icon. Before I ordered new batteries, I took this thing apart to inspect the circuit board, and I'm gonna show how to open this thing up, remove four screws, and the back part comes off. Remove two screws right here, and the front part slides down and open. And this is the part that took me a long time to figure out. There's three clips on the inside. One here, one here, and one here. Here's the clip. And I cut little pieces of cardboard and slide them in there to hold it open. Take this little piece of cardboard and put it in there so it doesn't latch. And I pry it open with the screwdriver. And I took out the circuit board and inspected and tested all the capacitors, looked the board over for burn marks, crack solder joints, everything tested and works perfect. So I ordered new batteries. I ended up buying genuine replacement cyber power batteries off Amazon. I'll have a link below of the exact thing I bought. You can buy cheaper ones, but you're risking it because they're probably low quality. You gotta make sure this thing lasts a long time. The old batteries read about 6.7 volts. New batteries are 12 volts. To change the batteries, you don't have to take it completely apart. All you have to do is take off the front panel. The batteries slide out. I made sure to take a picture so I could install everything exactly the same. Now plug it in. So it looks like everything worked okay. They say to let it sit here for a few hours, like four to six hours, so the unit charges up the batteries. And then I'll put it in my desk office, install my computer and everything into it. So that's the battery replacement procedure and how to open up the CyberPower 1500VA.